Hey guys, what's up? We're in the garage right now. Uh, what we're going to be looking at today is the top five things that you can get a car guy for cheap. Uh, this is all stuff that I basically either ordered from AliExpress or Wish or essentially just like really cheap Chinese websites. The companies are usually pretty good about refunds and stuff like that. I've done tons of refunds in the past two years or whatever that I've kind of like picked up a thing or two here and there. So it is very safe and this is stuff that you can usually get for like you know a ten dollar or less range the quality of the product always depends on which buyer you kind of go through some kind of are a little bit cheaper than others so sometimes it's worth spending the extra 30 cents for the difference in cost but you never really know until you buy uh, i would highly recommend looking at the reviews just to see kind of like if people uh, like the product when they got it and if it has lots of reviews and they're good reviews You can almost bet that you're gonna have a positive experience going through these guys It takes usually between 30 to 60 days now I have lately with these packages here. It took actually quite a bit less uh, usually I was looking at about two and a half to three and a half weeks so it was actually fairly solid but i imagine with more people buying stuff around the holidays that it might start to back up a little bit more so the sooner the better just as a disclaimer for you guys um shipping is usually free however you can pay to have it actually shipped a lot faster so that is also an option if you're a little bit behind so the first thing we're going to look at now I have used tons of these, they usually come in very good quality, you can't really go wrong. What I'm talking about is stickers. All the stickers that I've used in the past have been very well cut, they don't break or anything like that, you don't really usually have to worry about them getting like wrinkled or teared. If that does happen, basically with your order you can then open a dispute and just like anything else you'll get your money back or you'll get another one shipped in the mail. Now stickers are a great idea because you can find so many different ones that you can always kind of find one to match whoever you're buying for. So it's kind of awesome that way because they have humorous ones, they have just like serious ones, they have just like little emblems, they have ones like this where it's just like kind of like claw marks or something kind of cool but you know depending on who you are buying for there's going to be something out there. Now I'm going to take this a step further and I'm going to involve rap. Now rap is pretty cool. You lack of the stamina while you're divorcing Harrison Ford and I'm in a portion of flowing ports. Um, this stuff, essentially, you can get tons of different kind of flavors as to who you're buying for, just as with the stickers. Now, these are pretty cool because you can usually get a lot of carbon, whether it be uh, dry carbon or wet carbon, being like a glossy finish or more of a matte finish. Uh, you can get just simple colors like black, red, blue, green. Really, depending on who you're buying for, you can definitely find something. Usually the rolls come about this big, being about 19 and a half inches. That's what she said. But then you get different lengths. One of these three, I believe, can unroll for about 50 feet or so. So between these two, I'm sure you can find at least one of these that you know the person would absolutely love. Obviously, just peel off the sticker if you don't like it, but it's kind of like going to add a little bit more flavor to your vehicle, and that's exactly why I'm getting this stuff. So we're going to go on to number two, which is general cleaning supplies. Like, you can't go wrong with this. You can get a pack of microfibers for, I believe, like $3 online. You can get a bunch of standard cleaners. Uh, polishes, basically anything that you want, as well as microfibers for just a few bucks, and you know that they're gonna use them. Um, Brake Clean is a really good one that you could actually get them. Every single light in my truck, as well as my Ford Escape, as well as my girlfriend's car, as well, like literally, any light that you can change to ID is almost always the better option because it's a way nicer color. Uh, you specifically want to look for something probably within the 4500 to 6500 Kelvin range. Uh, basically, that's going to determine what color of light it is, but you can look up the Kelvin scale and it'll show you pretty much the entire spectrum. Otherwise, if you're given the option, you're probably going to want to go with a pure white, a white, or a cool white, as those are usually the more like kind of preferred options. It makes everything look way cleaner. Completely different vehicle after you install them. Number four should be a little bit kind of like easier to choose depending on what they do and don't have. It's kind of simple to narrow down. Now, I wouldn't go big scale unless maybe uh, they actually told you exactly, like if they send you the serial number of the tool that they want, go for it. But do not try to just like guess on tools, like any kind of jacks, jack stands, air tools electronic tools like uh, impact guns, 
Majority of tools, you're really not going to want to pick just because, depending on the person, they may or may not be extremely picky. These are very specific kind of tools, essentially, to make it so you can't really mess it up. Now I have these three. I think these are probably my top three. Uh, reason being is this one is actually a fairly nice uh, electronic tire pressure gauge and really you can't have enough of these like essentially this one is very simple it's got four different reading modes and it also has a little nice kind of like LED uh, light as well as display so you can kind of see what you're doing if you lose it or something when you're going to the track or if you somehow break it it's not really like a huge letdown but at the same time it is definitely convenient to have and then this one's going to slightly tie into number one, which is a squeegee. You can use this guy to actually apply all your vinyl stickers, your wraps. So this guy's extremely nice uh, quality and everything like that. And you can also get tons of felt tips uh, for squeegees if they already happen to have one and just need new ones. And realistically, like this is something you can't mess up and it's kind of a nice little stocking stuffer depending on how much vinyl and such you're doing. The last one here is actually Kind of what got me going on aliexpress is because i could not find one of these guys anywhere in the city that i live in it's a very simple tool but this guy needs batteries <laughs> basically what this does is you kind of take off this cap and you put this inside your brake fluid and what it does is it tells you whether it's safe or whether it's it should ideally be changed it's definitely not the most important tool but it's definitely something that's also convenient to have Number five is lanyards. I don't know about you guys, but I happen to have a lanyard for every single one of my vehicles. They're just a nice, convenient way to attach them to yourself and you will never lose your keys. As well as, you know, they're just kind of fun to swing around sometimes, depending on who you are. They're a very good device for anyone that happens to lose their keys, wallets, whatever, a lot, because you are essentially giving them something so they don't lose their keys again. You can find tons of like different little designs and stuff like that. Now, these ones I didn't get from AliExpress, however, I know for a fact that you would be able to find some kind of lanyard on there. I myself, I have this one here as one style, which actually has like a clip, so that way you can quickly detach it if, say, I need to give my girlfriend my keys, but I actually have it attached to me. I can just click this and it's basically a part. There's a simple lanyard, which, you know, is just basically a lanyard. And then the last one is probably the least advised because it actually has a beer opener on it. But hey, you know, there's probably a lot of people that would actually love to have this, so they always have one on them. These are three different types of lanyards. I'm sure you could find whatever type that you want but these things have literally saved my life from losing my only set of keys so many times. I, in fact, only have one pair of keys for every single vehicle I own because I never lose them. But these are one of my top picks. Those are five extremely cheap things that you can get any kind of car, truck guy, uh, even a bike guy, really. But I hope this helps some of you guys. Now, I'm going to include one extra bonus just in case uh, you don't have the option to really order online because it's a little bit too late. And this is something that a lot of car guys really need, but that's gonna be a knife. When you have massive boxes and there's tons of tape everywhere and you're opening parts all the time. My girlfriend got this for me about two Christmases ago and I used to carry it on me every single day when I was often working on my vehicles. So this is a huge help and as well as it's just very cool. Now this is often going to be a little bit more of an expensive gift, which is kind of why I left it for six, because it's just basically a bonus. It's not going to lie, it's probably going to be pretty hard to not find at least one thing in this pile that you know the person would love. This is tons of stuff I think a lot of car guys could appreciate, and it's very simple. Anyways, I have a lot more content if you guys would like to see on my channel. Usually I do a lot of stuff about my truck here. And uh, I do plan on expanding into more vehicles, being a car, and I do have my bike also, which I plan on doing more stuff with, as well as an SUV. So if you guys are interested, uh, feel free to like the video. Let me know if there's some other stuff that you would have put in this list uh, down in the description below. I hope you guys have a Merry Christmas. I hope this helped you out a little bit, and I hope you have a good holiday. I don't know. Do I have a good cat? <laughs> Ask Miko.
Okay, bye Miko. Bye Miko. <laughs>